Hello viewers, let's start today's class. Today we are discussing about multiplication. Already we have seen two digits times two, two digits. Now in this class we will see how we are doing three digits times two digits and three digits times three digits. So we have already seen that in multiplication uh, you should use your answer as two digits rather than one digit. So if it is one times three, then it's three actually, but you should make it as a two digit number that is zero three. So let's see few examples. So three one four times one eight. So total we have to count how many columns we should use. So that is three plus two five columns. So we, on our backers we should use these five columns. So first we'll multiply with the one. So three ones are three. So that is zero three. So from fifth column on zero three. Okay, zero three. Then it is zero one. So zero one. Then it is uh, one times four zero four. Okay, done. One with three one four. So now I will do eight with three one four. Eight with three one four. So eight times three is twenty four. So to put twenty four, first I had to leave this column because I'm leaving this one. So for this one, I should uh, remove one column. So that is. Uh, I am not including this fifth column. So now I will start my answer from here, adding the values from here. So three eights are twenty four. So plus five minus three plus four. I have to do how to do plus four. Mm, plus five minus one. So twenty four I have done. Next eight ones are eight zero eight. So I have to keep zero here and eight here to put eight. So how to add eight plus ten minus two. Okay, and next, uh, so my answer should be from here. For uh, eight four are thirty two. So plus five minus two, thirty two. So that's my answer. As answer, five six five two. So five six five two. Okay. So the next one, four ninety two times sixty nine. So first we have to do six with the four nine two. So again we need five. Four six are twenty four, twenty four. Then six nine is fifty four. So I must add five here, fifty. Four. Next, uh, six twos are twelve. One, two, twelve. So done. Next, I will go for nine with the four ninety two. So for six, I have to leave one column. Okay, done. Next, uh, nine fours are thirty six. So I need to add thirty six. Thirty six. Next nine nine is a eighty one. So eighty one. So eighty one. Next nine two is a eighteen. So one eight. So what's the answer? Three three nine four eight. So three three nine. Four eight. Good job. So let's see few more examples. Nine twenty eight eight times sixty. So we need five columns. Uh, again, we'll multiply six with the nine two eight. Nine six are fifty four. So fifty four. Next six two are twelve. So one twelve. Next six is a forty eight four eight forty eight. So the next one is zero. So we no need to do anything. So the answer is five five six eight zero five five six eight zero. Okay. 
so the next one 614 times 62 so let's do 6 6 are 36 36 next 6 ones are 0 6 next 6 fours are 24 okay done so next now with the 2 so I have to leave one column so done 6 twos are 12 how to add 2 here okay done next 6 2 ones are 2 0 2 0 2 then here 4 8s are 2 4 are 8 0 8 so the answer is 3 8 3 Eight zero six eight. Okay. Three eight zero sixty zero six zero eight. So the next question. Three zero five times sixteen. Zero three. Is it three zero five? Of course. I think so. 0 3 so next one is 0 0 next one is 0 5 next one 6 3 is 18 1 8 18 next 0 0 next one 30 3 0 so the answer is Four eight eight zero. Four eight eight zero. Okay. So let's see the next problem. So here we have three three. That is six columns we should use. Two eighteen. Three sixteen. So four five six. Two three is a zero. Three two is a zero six. Then three ones are zero three, then three eights are twenty four, twenty four. Next finish with one. So we have to leave our six column. Okay, so from here two ones are zero two. 0 1 0 8 1 8 are down next one 6 2 are 12 so we have to leave now two column so that is total 6 right so we have to leave these two then from here we will start 6 2 are 1 12 0 6 Next six is a forty eight four eight. So what's answer? So the answer is six eight 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 six eight 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 eight. eight. Okay. So the next question triple four times three six five. So total six. So four threes are twelve. Next four threes are twelve. Next four threes are twelve. Okay, done. So next we have to leave one column. Next we have to start from here again. Six fours are twenty four. Twenty, sorry, twenty four. again 24 again 24
four. Next, uh, four fives are twenty. So we have to leave two columns now. From here, we should add twenty. Two plus ten minus eight. Two zero. Right. Again, two here. Zero. Again, two here. Zero. So that was the answer. One six two zero six zero. So this is our end of class. We'll see remaining problems in the next class. If you like the video, please do share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye bye.